Dear viewers and all my esteemed subscribers, I am M. A. Mustafa. Welcome back to Ornate Pixels. Here is a 32 inch LED TV. I am turning on the TV to show you the problems. Look at the display. The image is frozen for a few seconds and the image is covered in the vertical bars. Then after a while the picture becomes normal. This problem is continuously occurring when the TV is turned on. Today you can gain some exceptional knowledge by this video. So stay with me for a while. Then I will explain very nicely how to solve this problem. Ok, let's get started. Here are the necessary circuit and no IC on this board of the panel. All bias voltages, data and signals are transferred by this LVDS cable. Tcon processor, DC to DC converter, gamma and logic level shifter circuit. All these circuits are integrated in this one IC. And from this IC, two connections are directly connected to the VGA's odd and VGA's even test point. Follow here, this is VGA's odd test point and this is VGA's even test point. Ok, now we will measure the voltages at these two test points. So I turn on the power again. Follow here carefully. This is VGA's even. A few seconds here is 26 volts and a few seconds is minus 5 volts. Ok. Now VGA is odd, 26 volts and minus 5 volts. Now watch the video clip. At the same time when even has 26 volts and odd has minus 5 volts, at that time there is no problem in the picture. So now we will find out where the VGA's odd and VGA's even voltages are coming from. And if you connect two wires here to measure it, it will be very convenient to measure. Ok, dear friends, if you have trouble understanding, please comment. This is VGA's odd. Now let's see which pin of IC has VGA's odd output. This is pin 47. Ok, now let's see VGA's even output. And this is pin number 48. So you have to cut two connections from here. Because in this situation, flip flop output voltage for COP is no longer required. Dear friends, very carefully cut very thin prints. Ok, now take two resistors for limited current follow in odd and even. From VGA's odd, connect the 330 ohms resistor to VGA's R because 26 volts are available here. Ok, then from VGA's even, connect the 33 ohms resistor to VGL because minus 5 volts are available here. Even to VGL, 39 ohms. And what to VGA is 330 ohms. Ok, I managed to supply constant DC instead of flip flop voltage at VGA is odd and VGA is even. Now with the satellite cable line, let's turn on the TV and see what happens on the display. Very nice. Dear friends, subscribe to the channel to get more videos. Like, comment, share please. Thank you so much.